Yo guys, what is up? Welcome back to another video and today yes we're doing another squad builder. Yes we are doing another squad builder just because FIFA 21 is dead and I'm st just struggling for content. I'm not doing any SPCs so I'm not getting anything for FIFA 22 just to let you know this which is unfortunate but it is what it is. Um, I just have to watch my bro Danes open up those packs and all those rewards for FIFA 22. But today we're here for League Un 25k team squad builder. Uh, is it going to be 25k? Nobody knows, but it's worth a try. We'll see how it is. I can then compare it once the game comes out and we can have a look uh, at it. Um, maybe like a, during a live stream or something along those lines. In this video, we are going to make it a 3 5 2 formation. Something different. Uh, we actually want the four at the back throughout the whole the other two videos that we've done and yeah so first of all thanks for one of the comments I uh, can't remember the name but it's gonna be on the screen somewhere for advising me just to buy a better keeper just because or just to get a better keeper in the squad builders just because they're worth less uh, these players are worth a lot less so it's just just keep that in mind right so the first keeper is gonna be um, it's gonna be actually a gold player uh, Walter Benitez still playing for Nice, I believe, and yeah, 81 rated, pretty straightforward. Six foot three, uh, looks like a decent keeper, 81 rated, and he does have one of the best in-game stats, I believe. So I thought I'd pick him. All right, the three centre backs. The first one, I'm gonna go with the first one. I'm gonna put him in the. Uh, middle uh, because I think he's the best one out of the three and yeah Tadebo um, my bro Danes has actually picked him already as well so but I've decided I'm gonna pick Tadebo although I'm a bit worried he might be a tad bit expensive but uh, another nice player so we've got two nice players already uh, green links all around the second uh, center back we've got ourselves um, a player who's on loan from Arsenal um, William Saliba I wish he played for Arsenal he's, ha he's having a really really good uh, season for Marseille I know he's not a nice player he's actually played he's playing for Marseille and he's having a really really good season from what I've seen from what I heard and I think he might get a little upgrade he might actually get a goal card if he does and look at his pace could be 72 73 and all of a sudden this card looks really good uh, for a starter team anyways if he stays as a silver, as a as a silver, he might be a, a little bit expensive. Okay, so we got another Marseille player. So so far, we've, uh, Nice and Marseille are just dominating. Uh, this player actually been transferred from Dortmund for 10 million quid, and looks like a really good centre back. Maybe medium. It's okay, but in the three at the back, I think it's pretty decent. And uh, acceleration is a bit of a downfall. But it just have, has decent stats. I mean, he's 68 rated. A bit disappointing, not gonna lie, but I think you will get that upgrade a little bit. Um, so maybe 70, 71, you never know. Anyways, CDMs. Let's start with the CDM. So the first one, um, again, taking a suggestion from, why am I putting CDM? Um, taking some suggestion from uh, my bro Danes, and it is gonna be Gwanduzi. Matteo Guanduzzi, a really, really good youngster. If I'm honest to you, I was. I'd take my Arsenal. Honestly, I would take him at Arsenal. Such a good player, so much passion, and just a really good player. Looks like we're just going for the French and Argentinian team so far, and Nice and Marseille by the looks of it. So let's make some changes. I, I think the next player is going to be Nice as well. So Nice is just killing it. Uh, but the next player is going to be another uh, midfielder, and it's going to be Cyprian. Uh, I think that's how I pronounce it. Like, apologies if I'm pronouncing it incorrectly, but that's going to be William. William and Cyprian and that's the name and it's gonna be oh don't tell me he's transferred has he okay as I said yes Cyprian is there so he's on loan from Parma and uh, I just wanted to make sure he is actually uh, in the Liga and he is so again a very good CD sorry CM look at his stats all 70s all around and I believe his high high 
uh, medium medium sorry so you can control the defense midfield quite well um, it does have four star skill moves which is really nice as well and three star weak foot pretty Okay, let's go into the cam position because this is quite boring, uh, if I'm honest with you. So this one is, is quite boring and I believe we have decided to go with Julian Draxler. Um, I think he's going to get downgrade as well. However, the only reason I've actually decided to pick him is because of his skill moves, skill moves and his weak foot. And I think, you know, having a, a pretty decent cam, I know he's not the fastest, but you can do all the other things. I need to stop yawning. I don't know what's going on. I, I hopefully I've cut it out. If I haven't, apologies. I hope you yawn too. So, as I was saying, Draxler, CM, uh, looks like a very good player. I mean, I've never used him in FIFA. I don't think, uh, but obviously he does have that finesse shot trait, which is really good from the cam position. He does have the flair, four star skill moves, and five star weak foot. So I think he could be really, really good in this position. Right. A bit more exciting times now so left mid I think I'm a bit worried about this one because it could be a little bit expensive but I'm gonna go for it Jonathan Bamba um, I've not gone for it. he's got quite a few informs as well so he might actually be like 82 which would mean that the card is gonna be very very expensive but I'm gonna go for it anyways um, 78 rated for now obviously four star skill moves four, four star weak for it looks like a very good card so yeah Jonathan Bamba definitely deserves to be in this team I don't know if he's gonna be cheap enough to be in a starter team but I think overall looks like a very very good team so far pretty standard pretty balanced in my personal opinion leave a comment down below what do you think so far whenever this focuses a hey. There we go. Right, so right mid. Again, a very, very awesome player to use. And it's gonna be Icon. <laughs> Ikone. I'm not sure if, if I'm pronouncing it correctly, but it's gonna be this guy. It's gonna be a right mid. Not again, I'm not sure whether it's gonna be a striker, because as you can see, he has got a striker card, or whether it's gonna be a right mid, but for now. We're gonna have to place him in the right mid position. Uh, I can four star skill moves, high medium, three star weak foot, really pacey, flair, just just a very good card overall. And I think this this looks really phenomenal for my in my personal opinion. And I think if you got it before, if you got this team, team during the EA access, I think it would cost you around 25k. Once the game gets released, all the prices do go up. And then after that, obviously, it, they'll start going down again. But um, yeah, we're really worth a try uh, of getting this team. All right, the two strikers. Uh, the first one was supposed to be Keita Balde, but he's actually transferred to some Italian team. Can't remember who, but so we're going to have two new players. The first one is going to be a silver player and it's going to be Gon Calves. Uh, Gon 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 Calve or in other words Wagner um, 90, 90 pace it, obviously as you can see does have that uh, I believe it's the silver stars so um, but yeah overall look at this 90 pace 71 shooting he's a silver so he might be a little bit expensive but you never know you never know to start with it may not be expensive so just keep that in mind I think it's just one of those really so um, yeah, nothing else to say. Really, four star skill moves, three star weak foot, really good card. And obviously, Kater Bolde couldn't do it, but but there is a transferred player, transferred player who is, um, again, a very good card. Is it going to be expensive? We don't know, but uh, it is going to be Boadu. I believe that's how you spell it. Uh, there we go. Here he is, Boadu from Finor. Not Finor. AZ Alkma. Um, so that's going to be the second striker. And I think, if I'm honest with you, if I look at the, this team, I think this team is the best team we've created out of the three teams so far the Premier League, um, the Bundesliga, and now Liga. Let me know in the comment section below if I should do uh, Serie A and La Liga, and if you have any interest. But it seems like you're loving these kind of videos now so i'm gonna maybe try and carry on maybe do some meta teams maybe do some hybrid teams etc but leave a comment down below leave a like down below if you enjoy 
if you knew make sure to subscribe and i'll see you in the next episode peace